Happening right now, the school board for the second largest school system in Central Virginia has gathered to decide how education will resume in the fall. Our Brendan King joins us from outside of the Henrico School Board meeting on Nine Mile Road. Brendan. Yeah, right now, Rob, the debate continues whether school here in Henrico County should return in the classroom or online. Starting since 11 o'clock this morning, uh, teachers and parents on both sides of the debate have gathered here at the Newbridge Learning Center in the East End. They're certainly voicing their opinions. They're holding signs, chanting as well. So we want to show you some of those images from here this morning. We know that the superintendent, Amy Cashwell, earlier this week sent parent and teachers an email recommending that school begin 100% online for at least the first nine weeks, citing the current health conditions in our area. The topic surrounding school certainly has been contentious. Many opinions about whether both students Students and teachers and staff return to the classroom or not during this ongoing pandemic. Some would quickly send their children back into schools, others hesitant because citing the health and safety of everyone involved. We do know that Henrico Richmond Health Dir District Director Danny Avula said he would recommend a combination of virtual and in-person instruction this fall. We spoke to a grandmother and then a librarian at Moody Middle School. Listen. I feel it's important for our children to be back in school and I understand there should be a choice and I, I agree with the choice, but there, there should be a choice, I think. But where's our choice? You're asking teachers to choose between teaching in a classroom where we can put our health and our lives or your kid going to school. We're not babysitters. At any minute now, this school board meeting is expected to begin. First, there'll be a public comment period that will be followed by a closed session where the board members are expected to return and then vote on the fate of the school session this fall. I'll be inside this room and I'll have a full update for you later this afternoon at four o'clock. Working for you in Henrico County, I'm Brennan King, CBS 6 News.